I'm on it. Bullying is a concern in, in any school these days. The assembly is a wonderful activity that we use to augment what we do with bullying. The Hill Brothers is a program that we use, probably done it for 10, 12 years now. This program gave a very good starting place for the conversations about what bullying looks like. There are specific skills that students can employ. Kids who have concerns about powerless situations felt empowered by the information that was shared, and this is uh, right on time and very useful for schools. But there's no place for bullies. I said there's no place for bullies. And another kind. They were age appropriate for the target audiences. The K2 uh, show was perfect for them, and the 3.5 was perfect for 3 through 5. You always are concerned about the time that they're going to remember it, if it's going to be 10 minutes or two weeks or six months, and this is one that has some lasting power. It really is kind of nice to see the kids sing songs uh, after the fact, hum things, and talk about what they saw and what they did and what the message was. I haven't seen the kids really sing that loud. They were really into it, and the enthusiasm that the Hill Brothers promote among the student population is really uncanny and uh, should be commended. It's great stuff. There's no place for bullies or outside of school, or on the school bus, or in the neighborhood, or even at home. There's really no place for bullying anywhere. But unfortunately, sometimes it does happen. And boys and girls, you may find that you see or you know about some bullying going on. And then you're going to have a choice to make. You could choose to ignore it. See anything? That wouldn't be the best choice. No. If you know about some bullying going on, it's more important that instead of being a bystander, you stand by that person. And you try to help that person. That doesn't mean you get involved in a fight or anything. We will help. We will help. Let's decide. Let's decide. What they have now is some common language and even some good catchphrases that teachers can refer to, that kids, the bystanders, can refer to and remind each other about using them. And I was so glad to see that the power of the bystander was really included in the presentation because uh, we see that really as the tipping point for turning the tide on bullying situations. If there's a bystander group and someone has the courage to say, that's not right. You can't do that. All it takes is one person. If you are that person and you're having a problem, do not be ashamed or embarrassed to get some help. I know that as well as anybody because it's something I had to learn for myself. I had a problem with a bully. His name was Vincent McGillicott. Yeah, that guy. I don't know why he was so mean and nasty to me. He was. But to me, he was simply Vicious Vinny. Well, yeah, you know, that's, that's kind of how I felt. Because it was kind of scary coming to school. Every day I'd have some kind of problem with Vicious Vinny. <laughs> During the next song, whenever I say, Vicious Vinny, <laughs> so they catch on fast. There's a curricular piece that they provide that we use with the teachers. There's things that um, we can prep the kids for. When they go into an assembly, they know why they're there, they know what the message is, and it's just reinforced, which is a wonderful way of doing it. This is very helpful programming for the new legislation in New York State. For the state standards, it deals with some of those CDOS standards that talk about being able to work cooperatively with each other. Spot on. I think it addresses everything. I like the fact that you included the piece about cyberbullying. We know that kids are engaged, they hear it, they retain it, and they revisit it when they learn things through the fine and performing arts. For us, this was a perfect fit. Absolutely. I, I think the message in the classrooms, on the buses, in the cafeteria has been very beneficial in, in keeping our discipline rate down. I would recommend them highly to um, other school districts. Look at me. The Hill Brothers do it. That's what I would say. They're great. <laughs> 